I've started drilling the elevators together through the elevator horn. I ended up using a few plastic boxes and a few actual boxes to make sure that the elevator was completely balanced on both sides. And it's kind of an awkward way to hold it all, but at least it's holding it solid while I put the, uh, the rivets in. And uh, here's how it's looking so far. There it is with all the 40 size Clecos in it. I've been using the um, next rudder section as a level to make sure that the area is completely flat back here and it's been working very well. Um, I need a large level of some sort and these types of pieces are um, bent very very specifically so I know that they're very level and I've been using that and now I'm going to flip it over and keep working the other side. The elevator is upside down right now, which is kind of an unusual view. You usually see it with the hinge on top, but I want to show you what it looks like this way. You can see how the hinge goes across on each side. And where it stops and where the um, pole goes through. On this spot right here, on the outside, uh, the actual rod will stop about halfway through, and then you'll drill a hole right about there, and you'll put safe, uh, not safety wire, but a cotter pin through it to keep the, the, the pin from ever going out. And then here is the other side where the elevator horn is going from this side in. There it is with all the Clecos in. I only drilled it to the 40 size. I need to go back and drill it to the 30 size. But I wanted to have all the Clecos in here just to see how sturdy it was. And I put pressure on both elevators, putting the opposite way. And um, it is strong, very strong. So I'm going to go back and drill up to the sizes and then disassemble it. And there it is completely drilled out. I'm going to disassemble it now and dimple die and uh, paint correct or paint corrosion proof it. Have the elevator hinge here painted up. It was pre-powder coated, uh, the stainless steel part, but I went ahead and sprayed it anyway. Then I put the uh, the rivets in on the left. I'm about to do it on the right side, and then I've already disconnected one of the elevators and starting to clean up the last bits on uh, the outside there. And I've already dimple dyed those parts. Uh, and uh, got to go over and do the same thing on the other side. Here it is complete. I'm going to stop for now. I've been working for a while, but I just want to show you what I've done so far.